Oh, just ignore that. Oh, that's God, this is I can't control it. <laughs> All right, everybody, this is take two of my second episode of 5PD with the guys. My first one, we recorded, we were going for half an hour, everything was going well, then my PC decided to kill itself, and the, um, the, the recording was corrupt. It was corrupted, or however you want to say that. So, we're going to try this again, we're going to jump on in here and see what we can get into, and we've actually got Speedo in here with us, um, who has been... Um, what do you want to call it? Who's who's going sit with us now? So we're gonna have a mixture of AI calls and civilian calls, which the civilian calls with real people will probably be a little bit more interesting because then we can give commands and, and do all that sort of stuff. So without any further ado, we're gonna jump on in here and see what we can get into. Alrighty, so while we're just cruising through here and kind of doing a beat sweep through the area, I'm gonna we found farm. Now oh, that's going to be up in the county. We're going to ignore that. Uh, we want to keep it central to the Davis metro area. I'm going to run up here to the gas station and, and top off my tank here. And uh, see what kind of fun stuff we can get into. I like this car a lot. Um, when we get to the gas station, I'll show you guys the car. I went with the unmarked 2020 because uh, they didn't have an LAPD style 2020 that I wanted. Um, I prefer slick tops, man. I think they look clean. I don't ever, I don't, I don't ever, um, have an issue with going with like a marked unit with the light bar. I wanted to go slick top today. I went slick top last, last episode too. So, oh, I am so sorry. Um, I might have to change it up a little, maybe halfway through this episode or something. We'll see how it goes. But the, uh, LAPD style car that I wanted to go with, they did not have, which would have been a slick top 2020. So we went with this one, but the thing that you guys will notice here probably relatively soon is how stupid fast this car is. For some reason, this thing is just absurdly fast. But this is the car. Yes, I know. I've got lights all over the place. Sue me. Um... This has got the running board lights, you know, the, the back. I really don't have a problem with the front. You know, most people are like, you can't run grill lights with a ram bar light. You can't run visor lights with a light bar. But most of the agencies in the real world, they have visor lights, dash lights, and light bars. Or they have the, you know, the rear window lights, which my car's dirty, I just realized. And... Because at the end of the day, it's not about if it looks good. It's really, it really just turns, it really just ends up being about officer safety. And that's why a lot of the times in the front of the car, for example, it's going to be lit up like a Christmas tree. So we, uh, we got gas, we got the car here. I don't know what the inside looks like. Nothing fancy. We do have our shotgun here, our prisoner partition with our MDT. So yeah, I mean nothing fancy. It works. I broke. Clear. Two like a one one five. You copy the call. Uh, ten nine last. Uh, call eight four five Grove Street. Male causing disturbance, armed with a weapon. If you could flip around, go down Grove Street. Uh, two Lincoln sixty nine. It's gonna be right off the road. Two Lincoln. One will be in route shortly. I'll be 1019 for watch command. Hey, from do we have a, a description or an exact location? Is it going to be a cul de sac? Hey, from blackmail, uh, unknown clothing. Hey, from all right. So we just arrived 23 on scene. Look at this dude. Man, what the fuck y'all Hey, what? how's it going, man? Can I help you? Can you do me a favor and not do that while I'm talking to you, please? 
Why are you on my property? Well, we got we got a call regarding a disturbance in the area. Well, that fucking sucks, don't it? What what's what's the deal, man? Why why are you being a hassle what here? What do you mean? I'm not being an asshole. I'm living my life, man. I didn't say asshole. I said a hassle. Oh, hassle. Even then, I'm, you know, I'm not doing that. I'm just living my damn life, bro. I understand that, sir, but at the same time, you're disturbing the peace around you and your neighbors are complaining. Oh, fuck them. They're assholes. They're little bitches anyway. They're just mad that I'm the only OG left on this damn block. Well, how about this? Run me your information and I'm going to check everything out. We'll go from there, all right? Why do I got to give you my information? Because you're on a traffic stop. For, I, really? For what? I haven't driven my car off of my private property. Okay, well, my, my apologies. You're not on a traffic stop, but regardless, you're on, on a scene. Can you stop doing that? For, for my safety and yours, please stop. I mean, I'm pretty safe. I don't know about you. I need to see your identification or I'm going to take you in for failure to identify. Take fucking kiss my ass. I don't know why I said traffic stop. He's not on a traffic stop. I'm still Here, trying. Man. All right, go ahead and sit tight for me. Hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good, man. Hey, Sarge, you want to come here for a second? Oh, just ignore that. Oh, that's... All right, well, we'll get the fucking... HR form. All right, here, fill that out. You broke the window. Fill that out. Anyway, what you got? Uh, so I got this guy here who's causing a disturbance in the area. Was this the uh, gentleman that was walking around armed? Uh, yeah, I, I, I mean, I got the same ball. I think they said that he was brandishing a firearm. Okay, well, he's in his car. He's using his hydraulics, bouncing around. Uh, he's not really listening to orders. It took a fight just to get my his ID from him. But you, he did give it to you, though? Yeah, I'm running it right now. Okay. Uh, run him, see what comes back. Yeah, let me Looks see like the name comes back for three prior arrests for drug possession, two prior citations for speeds, red light violation, a written for obstruction, and the subject is currently out on parole. I guess it's probable cause to get him out of his car and search him. So. All right, here's your clipboard back. Thank you. Don't worry, that'll be filed soon. Oh, I'm sure it will. Yep. All righty, All sir. Right, sir. Find a car that works in everyone's eyes. You have any drugs, knives, guns, anything in the car? Need to know about? <laughs> it's none of your business. All right, well, I need you to go ahead and step out for me. For what? Because you're on parole. Okay, and? So I need to I need to pull you out. I need to search you. Make sure you're not violating your parole. This motherfucker here. I swear to God, I hate the LSPD. All you gotta do is hassle somebody trying to live their motherfucking life. Go ahead and face away. Alrighty, what do you got two grand on you for? Because it's my money. Alrighty, well, I'm just gonna set that stuff here on the uh, on the trunk. You can turn around if you want. Alrighty, sir. So here's the deal, man. I mean, we responded to a call that you are brandishing a firearm and that you were disturbing the peace. I'm just trying to do my job here, make sure that everything's kosher. You know what I mean? At the end of the day, if, if all checks out, you know, you're going to be good to go. You do have quite a rap sheet um, for, for a few different priors, but everything checks out. And if uh, the vehicle search checks out, you should be good to go. Okay. We can, like, hurry this up, man. I got shit to do. Hey, don't open my door. Hey, re relax. Focus on me. You're a felon on parole. Nah, you know, man. Don't open my car. damn door. The fuck? Excuse me? I said don't open my door. You're a felon on parole. I can open that if I want to. D oh, so I could just go to your car and open your door? I wouldn't advise that. No, because I'm not a felon on parole. Then get your ass out of my car. No. <laughs> Fucking assholes, I swear to God. What was that? This is why I hate the fucking LSPD. Why? Because you broke the law. It's our fault. 
No, because you motherfuckers think you run everything. to hem somebody up uh, on everything. Well, guess what? Now you're going to be detained. For what? Because that's what we're doing right now. That, you fucking... I swear to God, power hungry ass bitches. Right, let's sit over <laughs> this here. guy. All right, well now you get a nowhere. Now you got to get a sit. I will oh. drag you over here to sit down. I don't have to fucking walk over there. Hey, Eat. guess what? You're a felon on parole. I'm giving you a lawful order to comply with orders. Eat my ass. You're required. To okay, you want to go to prison? I'll come back up. Do what? Oh, look at that! You got a burner. Yeah, you could take him, uh, Jeremy. What'd you find in there? There's a burner. Man, these motherfuckers. Alrighty, buddy, let's go. Man, you're lucky I can't fucking do shit. These goddamn handcuffs. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and get into my car and have you file in the back. Beat your little white boy ass. What, you wanna go for that too? What? What are you going to hit me up with now? You ain't got a body cam on. Criminal threats? Eat my ass. How about that? My dash cam caught everything, so don't worry about it. Oh, fantastic. Hey, Sarge. These motherfuckers. Yeah. Yeah, we're tagging on criminal threats, too. All right, Joey's going to talk to him about the, the gang shit. Uh, tack on the felon in possession of a weapon. Okay. All righty. I'm going to go right up this report. Alrighty, so we caught this guy. He was he was stated to brandishing a firearm. He's being very uncooperative, uncompliant, making threats. We're gonna go ahead and and take him in for not only violating his parole, but for the criminal criminal threats and the possession of firearms. Two Tom one one five two Sierra six zero seven. Good. How many counts of fire uh, possession of a firearm does he have? Uh, one, two counts of criminal threats. And if, is uh, violating a parole the penal code? Negative. You have to, when you get to the station, call his parole officer and let him know that you're booking him. A firm. They'll, they'll probably file a DOC warrant. Okay. Alrighty. Begins writing up arrest report. Times one. Possession of a firearm while on the roll times two criminal threats. Hey, Mr. Brown. What? Is this your house right here? No. Okay, so I'm gonna throw the car then. It is my house, goddammit. Oh, you said no, sir. It is. I didn't want y'all to fucking search that, too. Now it's not a... Oh. I mean, I'm not going to search your house because you weren't in your house at the time, but you, I mean, yes, you, are, you already house. know what's going on with your car. You, you know what you've been doing. Man. All right, I'm going to take him in. Call his PO on the way. All right. Two Tom 115, show me 97 I'll station. I'll come back one and booking. get all of you white boys. I swear to God. Uh, is that another uh, another count of threat? You I leave, shut the fuck up. I leave up. my door unlocked at night. So come on. You're kinky. I wouldn't fuck with him. I will fuck you up. Will you? Maybe. I haven't decided yet. And right now you're looking at, you know, fucking baseball bat level. Hmm. Okay, well. I'll make sure they put you in a cell with Bubba. Alrighty, Mr. Brown, they're going to be taking you now. You take care. Fuck off. Two Tom 115, show me back 10 8. Two Tom 115, do we have any calls on the board right now? Uh, we're gonna be on a 10 11, uh, 849 forum with a reckless driver. Uh, 10 4, I think I see you guys. So we're going to show up on this call. Not that they need us on this call, but we're just going to back them up. <clears throat> Repair your car.
That's a hell of a cop you had there, sir. Okay. Yeah. I hate it when that happens. Yeah, well, you know. Okay, bye. Have a wonderful time. He just ran that just red light. Two Tom 5 I've already lost eyes on him. He must be moving pretty fast. Clear. Seen him run, running a red light is all I saw. So we wanted to get on scene and kind of assist with that traffic stop, even though it was absolutely unnecessary to have that many units on scene there. Uh, and then he takes off on that from that stop and just completely blows that red light. So we're going to be on the lookout for him. And I think once and if we get another call generated here with the uh within the 5 PD script, we'll probably jump on that as well just kind of shake things up a little bit. But I don't know where he could have gone. Like a 69, I got him. He's going uh, westbound Ray Lowenstein. Uh, just made a right on to um, We're gonna be in the back of the Mega Mall taking the little alley to the front parking lot Two time 115 gonna be around It'll be a failure to yield at this time I'm gonna call out a penalty. Hey, firm. Two Tom 115 is gonna be secondary in pursuit. We're gonna be taking a right hand turn onto Forum Drive. He's gonna be taking a left into the alleyway behind Forum. We'll be taking a right. Should be coming out to, I believe, Davis. Adam Five's got out. Oh, yeah, he snuck by you there. He's gonna be taking another right onto Forum. A left into the alleyway. Gonna be an active 1080 for sure. Crossing the railroad tracks. Let me still for them. Now we're in the alleyway, popping out onto Strawberry. Uh, innocence, innocence. My apologies. Innocence. Eight four nine. Closing. Continuing taking a left onto Elgin. Eight three five. Looks like he's gonna be getting uh, U turn. Ooh, that was close. That was very close. I was getting onto the four uh, eastbound four eight three five. Uh, he's hitting locals, reckless, slamming on the brakes. And just just collided with another local here, getting off the four eight one one near La Mesa. We taking a right hand turn onto Popular Street. South on popular postal eight ten. Secondary, if you want to take calls. Right, going Capitol Boulevard westbound eight twelve. Making another right. He's on the railroad tracks. Little Bighorn Ave. Exiting off for Little Bighorn ten fifty. Going to be eight two six ten seventy. He's going into the Ellis River. My God, this car! I can't control it. <laughs> Stop. Stop running. We're going to the Ellis River northbound. Stop running. 811. Okay. He's taking the ladder back up top. One time stays are deployed. Don't you move. Stop moving. God. Two 
Two time one one five shots fired. Roll me additionals. We're gonna be in the canal seven uh, seven six three. Don't you fucking move. Fuck you. I totally meant to shoot him because he was he was taking a swing at law enforcement and I missed and then he was gonna go up the ladder and I was gonna tase him again until he started beating my ass and my character wouldn't do anything about it. Two Tom one one five, two Lincoln one, you got him secure. Hey friend. Copy one times ten fifteen. Oh, that's stupid. Okay. Lincoln one, the two times um, six or seven. Good. You good, sir? Never. Two time one one five. Can we have somebody search the vehicle up top? Never. I'm two Lincoln one home. Get on it since my car's up there. Hey, okay, fireman, I mean, let's get medical and route for this. Where did you come from? Where did you come from? Oh, okay. okay. It, uh, yeah, so him? he. You shot him? He started swinging at officers. I did shoot my firearm, but I didn't hit him. He went to. Uh... Hello? Can you hear me? Hello? Talk. Oh, there you are. Yeah, so I, I fired my weapon at him. I missed. He was punching. Um, Two Lincoln 01. He went to climb back up the ladder, came back down and started hitting me, and oh, Two Lincoln 01 shot and killed him. Oh, good shit. Well, I don't know if he's dead or not, but he definitely got filled well, with some rounds. Yeah, it's a little, a little so, poisoning. Yeah, well, you know. Oh, look at that. He's still alive. Oh, don't worry, man. We got uh, we got medics in route for you. All right, everybody. Well, that is where we're going to wrap up this episode of 5PD. I hope you guys enjoyed. We're having a lot of fun here. Um, so expect more to come. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Once again, guys come out and watch it and take care. Have a great night. We will see you next video.